we're continuing the ranked grind today back on and these are the games that i had just kind of coming up so you'll see a couple of, i've already played some games and i've been really on the climb you'll be good to know that after today's session we end off with an even more positive record and that game three baby if you are a nami player worth your sweat you're gonna love how it ends coming down right to the wire coming down to the triggers Woo! it's a good one enjoy we're playing all the all the black players today right now that's what it seems like um all right you know what i'll i'll force this I'll force this for what it's worth. I'll force this. It's a pretty active use of my Dawn, which probably isn't that bad. Yeah, they have a Hound Blaze. Sure. Yeah. It's a pretty it's a pretty active use of my Dawn, so why not? Might as well. Let's let's work against the Sakazuki Menace as long as it's here. The Zeph will just be a gonna counter out here. Will they be attaching some? Hina coming down. No attacks interesting um we could just force the use of the hound blaze here yeah why not force the use of the hounds blaze just put the nojiko at the bottom that way it's not like akaya being like thrown down there that i could potentially just bounce in the future here definitely a character that like whatever it, it got its use it was tempo they used three dawn and didn't swing so it's kind of just like eliminating the value of that one whole turn. So that's kind of really nice there. Let's see if we can't bring it back with this one. That last game just again, it's kind of why like, I don't know, a lot of folks on the channel will ask me like even in DMs and stuff like, um, why don't you play more Sim? And that situation was why just like really frustrating. It feels like, again, like in hindsight, like obviously, yeah, like maybe we could have played it a little differently, but we definitely could have like, we could have drawn more cards. If I knew I was drawing two cards, I would have just like spotted to the bottom, probably spotted to the bottom was probably correct in that situation. But anyway, don't want to dwell too much on it. Honestly, don't want to dwell too much on it. Just a really frustrating aspect of the sim. Uh, yeah, like when, when you play this many Nami games, um, even though like I may not have that many in ranked, just even outside of rank when you play that many, it really adds up. I'm, I'm not even sub 30 yet. This game's going real slow here. Only taking their time playing the Hina now. Okay. Um, I mean, I mean, yeah. Deploy this, find that. Uh, that's a pretty good sequence of cards just to draw into a bunch of things, right? Um, maybe we do. I don't know. Like, what's what's better here? All depends on how the end game lines up. Um, I think this is fine though. Based on this hand, how do I, how do I want to do things? One, two, one, one. Can't even attack anything. Like this can't be KO'd by battle. So, mm, all right. The other option was bouncing the Rebecca, but like, why would I do that? So they can play another Hina? <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, why would I even do that? Um, yep. So they bottom decked the Nuge. They bottom decked the Nuge, but at least it's with the Ama. Um, they don't get two characters off that, so that's kind of nice there. Um, in this case, just gonna just gonna do that early. See how they play this. Yup, definitely just redraw here. I love me some good redraws. We're gonna be able to draw some cards here. Um, if we go the whole Zeph route, like they're definitely like removing, but I don't know if there's really a better thing that we can do. Well. All right. Let's deploy bounce. I don't want to use up. See, you know what? The Zeph was a mistake here. This is probably a mistake because I could have just gone Kaya bounce. 
I could just take a bunch of hits and go Kaya Kaya. It might actually be correct. Honestly, it might actually be correct. Yeah, let's do that. It, it might actually just be correct. Let's just go Kaya Kaya. Now that I committed to the Zeph line, I gotta keep the Deathwink. I gotta keep the Deathwink. I lost my I lost my two Kaya. I, I lost my other Kayas. I have to keep the Deathwinks. Yeah, if I just went Kaya Kaya, would have been would have been much better. I would have just been able to go deeper. But it's good. They're 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 having to use up Dawn. Um, yeah, I just killed the Zeph, so that's fine. Fortunately, no trigger there. We're going to take at least two more hits here. But we are going to be able to re-up. I mean, we did we did get a fair ways through our deck there. We were able to mill out six cards. We were able to mill through six cards. Leader ability being used. Yep. That hit. No triggers is absolutely insane. Yep. Both, both my Kaios are gone in that case. If I can find a Mr. One, that would be beautiful here. Beautiful. Uh, probably just want to draw it like this. Mm, deploy the Mr. One, grab a gavel. Then we can go two, two, one, three. Hopefully draw a character. Hopefully just draw a character here. So we'll swing into the 2k. They'll just block there. That's fine. Swing with the buggy next turn if they end up swinging with the Tashigi. I don't I don't think they will, but you know, we can count out a lot uh this time around. Sakazuki ability. We can get through one, two, three, four, potentially six cards down to 14 here, which could be pretty dang big. unfortunate i will say that that is we have to take a hit here yeah, we're gonna have to take a hit here sends buggy to the bottom sends big buggo to the bottom yep looks like we're gonna have to take a bunch of hits here take that one three of my triggers being love love beams is absolutely di diabolical it's it's diabolical like actually diabolical holy <laughs> like truly you're killing me right now you're killing me right now yeah it's gonna have to be i'm gonna have to drop the death wink here let's see how things let's see how things line up let's see how things line up let's see how things line up here yep we're close. Uh, I think if we can survive this turn, we're in a really good spot. If we can survive this turn, we're in a really good spot. Leader ability goes through. We're close. We're at 12 cards. We can get through a lot here. Yep. Let's hit this trash and then pitch that. Yep. Probably do want to take this. That's a great trigger. Finally. Like, finally. Ooh. Yep. So let's rearrange. I do like that. Keep cards on top. Let's keep that on top. Crash. Yep. Let's redraw. So what I can do is like I can oh no, but they could I don't want to get too far here. Yeah, trash that for counter. I don't want to get baited by this actually. They can attach three dawn and then yeah, yeah. okay. So just let them take my last hit. <sighs> okay. Yeah, okay, so we're gonna have to use this trigger. So this pushes a Mr. One up to the top. 
So I have a Mr. One at the bottom. So this, this is actually like crazy math right now. So this pushes a Mr. One to the up to the top. I draw one card. I draw two cards. Want them to be characters. So I'm gonna play I'm gonna play this plus Mr. One. Like I'm essentially drawing to six, then I have to get through six cards. I draw for three dawn. I draw the Mr. One for four dawn. Play the Mr. One. Grab a gavel. And then gavel lets me go through two. And I just have to line up characters really at the top. I have to place these at the bottom. And then I think it's got to be this order. Yeah, it's got to be that order. I think this is correct because they bottom deck the Mr. One, which actually is going to come in clutch here. There it is. Did I do that incorrectly? No, I did that correctly. Deploy, grab myself a gum gum gavel and yeah, that's GG. Okay. Whew. Ooh, we got there. Um, yeah, 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 we got there. As long as they don't bottom deck, that's my fear right now. And if they bottom deck, there's not much I'm doing about it. But based on how I drew it up, there's not much I'm doing about it. I think I'll put Deathwink at the bottom. Huh. I could grab the Deathwink. That was like one option. I can grab the death wink potentially just to like take a card out that way. If they bottom deck one thing, I still have the ability to mill through. So that's probably correct. Um, I could actually grab two cards here. Yeah, that's actually probably correct. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Grab two cards. So grab the brick fist. Um, return then I can grab no hold on I don't want to do that I don't want to grab breakfast I just have to hope on them not having like two because I need to go gavel pitched and then death wink because if I grab thing then I can only draw one card oh no but it's that's that's what I need yeah wait 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 I'm, I'm actually being just dumb here it's the same. It's the same thing. It's the same thing. This is just using more Dawn. But it's the same thing. Yeah. So if they bottom deck a card, I can still. Yeah, it's the same thing. I like regardless, I lose if they have double bottom deck. If they have double bottom deck, I lose. I, th I think. Let me know in the comment section down below. I think I might be overthinking it. I can account for one bottom deck. If they have double bottom deck, I lose. Yeah, they're just going to... Yeah. Right. Well, GG's. Woo! We got there. Continuing the ranked sim grind. Choose to go first. I'll keep this. I don't mind. Um, probably good, good to go down on some cards here. Probably drop a Deathwink this early. And... Probably a Deathwink and a Love Love Beam. Not ideal. Like, these are definitely cards that we want to see later on. But that's okay. It's okay. We'll make it work. So, bring in the Perona. Yep. That's what I was figuring. This card is actually so dumb. Um, Like, primo dumb. It's actually premium dumb. All right. Drop this because I don't want to... I don't want to bounce that. Um... Okay. Um, yeah, just return it in that order. It's fine. What I'll do is just do this. If they have another Perona, so be it. Like, this card's actually so dumb. Like, five is the threshold, not six. Not seven. This card is so dumb. But it's okay. 
Let's not get salty over it. Let's not get super salty over it. And I was realizing one piece of criticism right now from the previous video was I made my camera a little too kind of on the low side. So I'm just going to lift it because people couldn't see the cards that I would kind of rearrange. So let's just do that. Um, I think I'm going to bounce the Kaya, honestly. Uh, but I can't really do that, can I? Oh, let's bounce that. I probably should have kept the buggy there. Um, the buggy could have found uh, another piece there. So I'm going to I need to take this hit. Probably going to return. Yeah, so they're going to KO my Kaya. It's kind of why I wanted to bounce it, but oh well. Um, resolve, no trigger. Okay, so let's start attacking. I right, get some cards out of their hand. Um, obviously this, I don't know, this gives them a target. It's not great. Like, I don't know. It... <laughs> I don't know it kind of just gives them a target that's probably that's probably something i got a hard learn in this matchup like perona is like if it feels like every time i come up against moria they always have it but it's okay uh, in this case they'll bring it back and i can drop um i would just drop the i have no mm, probably just drop this and then i'll just redraw here and then probably just redraw again. So this this gets rid of like two attacks here. Yeah, this gets rid of two attacks. That is so unfortunate. That got rid of the gavel and I drew that. It's actually so unfortunate. Oh well. Should have really thought about that. Especially, I honestly probably should have just dropped the overheat. That was like I was thinking about it, and the overheat was probably the the correct drop here. Okay, well, I, I have a card to lose. <laughs> I don't mind. I don't mind. On plays. On plays. Yeah. Yeah, I don't mind. Honestly, it's a, there you go. Problem solved. <laughs> like, truly problem solved. Uh, I could just I could just overheat the brand new. Um, Use this for thing. Yeah, I, I think. I mean, I'll attack it. sure just make sure that they're the noggin is there if they bring back the prona sure um i guess they will here yep and then i'll probably just drop the overheat uh do i drop the overheat or do i drop the death mm. Hmm. i draw another death wink i don't know it's probably eh. it's probably just not better to just be drawing more cards right so uh let's redraw it's good i'll take that for what it is and then start by placing cards on top honestly it's not a it's not a bad set actually place at the bottom let's do that yeah let's place that at the bottom we got a kaya set up at the bottom so we can keep that there yep so that just removes that 5k attack perfect this Double Deathwink is a nightmare. Let's do this. Um, pass the turn from there. We're in a not bad spot. We know they're going to do the same thing again. My Dawn usage is going to be 1-1. One, one. So I could just do this. Yeah, my Dawn usage is going to be 1-1 one, one, and 3. So so just, just getting that out of the way so that it's just not a thing that can attack me. Um, they are pretty kitted up here. But I think I can dodge most attacks here. Let, let's see how this works out. Let's see how this works out. Um, it's not great, but. Trash a card. Yeah, it's 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 not great. So it looks like I'm going to have to take some hits, but. Okay. Yep, they'll return something. So it won't be like a Perona. It'll be like a yeah, an Absalom will will kill my Mr. One. Um, that's fine. Yep. So we'll do this. Crash two cards. So kind of just coming in blank here. Bait that attack. They swing Borso. They will swing Borso. Definitely use that trigger. Oh lordy lord. Oh, 
again, if we were not playing on the sim, this is why I don't want to play rank sim. This is like moments like this. I don't want to play rank sim because if I was in paper, I would just be able to play this and get it out of my hand. Oh, that's so brutal. It's actually so brutal. I'd just be able to play this. Like I'd actually just be able to draw three cards. Now I'm drawing two, which is a, like actually a massive difference. Um, I guess I'm swinging at Perona actually, but <sighs> situations like this, situations like this. Double Moria is just really unfortunate. I got Perona like three times this game too. So, oh well. But the grind continues. It's very, it's very close. It's very close. Let's redraw. Might as well, right? It's going to have to be that way. Yeah, take the hit. Yep. Trash for counter and then redraw that. We can just bait out one attack here. I think we might end up losing this round, honestly. Just like really unfortunate set of triggers like if we were able to just draw two cards there like truly i think we would in be in a slightly different place okay not bad it's all all depends on what i draw here so if they pay the two they won't pay the two for the borso which is smart fortunately that's the l but it's okay. The rank grind continues. We take the L there. Uh, they will not pay the two. Uh, we are close, though. Honestly, we were close. We were close. Last match for today's grind. Um, let's make it happen. Let's go second against yellow. Um, definitely a more aggressive matchup. I think in terms of how they play out their board. So I'm actually kind of not mad at the bounce effects in hand. So I think I'm just going to play it out. I'm, I'm kind of not mad at it. Yeah. Let's see how they play. They they might just like go Ohm and a Holly here. Uh that's fine. I'll just uh I'll just Do I counter this out or do I no, I'll take the hit. Okay. Okay. <laughs> all right. Um all right. I was really hoping they would play some type of the three drop there, but okay. Banish it is. I can counter this. That's I can counter this. <laughs> I'll tell you that. Um, no problem. Uh, yeah, let's let's do that. Let's let's counter that. No value. Thought maybe I could get a cheeky little trigger out. Uh, absolutely. No, no, no. Uh, I do not want to use that thing's effect, but uh, let's let's just let's just pass. Maybe maybe they'll have some some things for me to bounce on the coming turns. You know, maybe maybe um, I like that little redraw. I like that little redraw. Uh, yeah, I grant you, grant you a life. That, that sounds A-OK -okay to me. That sounds A-OK -okay to me. Next turn, we're going to eight. I will happily play Zeph here, especially if I could, if I could just find a one cost event. Uh, that'd be great. I'm at four life, 36 cards. This game is going nowhere. My, I, I am not able to mill over anything uh, at this point. So let's deploy this. No targets. Trash some cards. Lost a pilaf. <laughs> Lost a pilaf. Fun, fun, fun. Fun, fun, fun. <laughs> Just no. Oh god, I hate this deck. All right. Um. All right. Uh. Yeah, they're not. Not doing a lot. I'm not doing a lot. Let's let's counter out there, and then we can we can use uh, we we can use this. Definitely not bouncing your your Onami. All right, we're uh, we're digging, we're digging. Definitely just I think we just want to get rid of these at this point. Um, we are really not able to find anything, but we're finally we're finally drawing some cards. I, I, I will say that I, I really want to try and use this Mr. One to get back a gavel once. That's a ton of value. They did get out the Yamato. That is, that is a card. I, I You know what? Honestly, I haven't played against NL in forever. It, it honest like I honestly have not come against NL in forever. So 
This is uh this is a fun one. This is a f oh okay. All right, 7k it is. Um All right, I'm going to do this and then oh Hallelujah. We found ourselves some some one piece cards. Check it out folks. We found ourselves some one piece cards. All right, r relax there. Everyone just 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 bring it down. Bring it down a little. Okay. Double Deathwing, not a fan, not a fan, not a fan of the Double Deathwing, but that's okay. Not a fan of that either. Looks like we're taking a hit. Okay, no trigger, no trigger. We're going to get back our gavel. Get back our gavel. Honestly, if I could, I would have Deathwing there, not going to lie. Definitely would have Deathwing there. Uh, attack the Onami. Force the 5k uh, block. What really sucks here is I can't really get rid of this death win like I need to get rid of this this uh impel it's just gonna have to be that um okay end the turn I I don't think we're in a great spot like their board's kind of wide last thing I need is 10 cost mom I don't think NL really plays 10 cost mom though so that's kind of like the big benefit of that oh, now that 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 is a card to draw now, see, now I'm up on my chair. That, see that right there? That's a card. That's a one piece card right there. That that right there is an event to draw, baby. Come on. That's how we win games. All right, new opponent. New opponent to the same. Take advantage, free swings. Opponent not in their head. They don't know what's going on right now. They, they, they don't know what's going on right now. They don't know what's going on right now. Happily, get rid of that. Easy. Opponent not understanding what the situation is right now. Easy. Easy. Come on. Opponent not understanding what the situation is right now. Easy. 18 cards. We got through like six cards. I think. Uh, grant you a life. Yeah. Got through like six cards there. Holy. Not the most ideal draw. Because that could just draw into... Truly, that could draw us into, like, anything. So, all right. Kill the Onami. I hate that that's swinging at me for free. But, okay. They're going to they're gonna protect it. That's fine. We're going to end the turn. We're going to be taking some hits. Really, if I was at, like, 10 cards right now, much better situation. I'm at 20. They have a full board here. This is actually a really scary situation. Redraw. Love it. Love it. Perfect. Couldn't have couldn't have wound it up any better. Couldn't have wound it up any better. Swing Yamato, please. Okay. That's not bad. That's a lot of Dawn commitment. So I'll take it for what it is. So we're taking some hits here. But we're getting close. We're getting close. I think they're going to be swinging wide here. Definitely. Oh. It's okay. Pilafs better in triggers, better in triggers, so they say. Uh no trigger here. If they swing one more time, I can draw two cards. Perfect. Trash card. Draw two cards. Beauty. And we found a Kaya. And we get to take a trigger here. Yeah, use this trigger to bounce the Kaya. Okay. I don't think this is going to be a Zeph motion. Deploy. Ooh, baby. No! card what is this last card i don't think i bottom decked anything this game damn it no it's so close yeah. 
damn it. Come on. Trigger one time. Trigger one time. One time. One time. Yo, let's go! Let's go! Come on. Come on. Yo. That is the trigger of the century. <laughs> Let me tell you that had me clenched, baby. That is the trigger of a century, baby. That's how you win your games are ranked. That's how you win some ranked games, baby. Come on.